strong. Hi guys, welcome back to Sai 3 Coding. Today we are going to see how to do a dodgeball game in PictoBlocks. So for that, first of all, it's a size of 2B to 7P. Okay. Uh, this backdrop. I've just blue sky as backdrop. So let me keep picture. So now go to events and drag and drop when green flag clicked. So uh, now let's go to looks and drag and drop show and switch backdrop to blue sky. Okay. Now go to motion and drag and drop go to x y. So give x as minus nine and y as minus one twenty. Now go to controls and drag and drop forever and if then take uh, another one so let's go to sensing and drag and drop that if if key if key right arrow pressed then change x by 10 change Oh, let's change it, change x by 10 and okay uh i'll do i'll duplicate this so if key left arrows left arrows press change x by minus 10. okay now just now i'll go to costume uh i will delete other costumes of toby okay I will copy this and uh, paint, paste, and flip horizontal. So let me see the name of the costumes Toby and Costume 1. So if key right arrow is pressed, uh, switch, switch costume to Toby. So if key left arrow is pressed, switch costume to costume one see, let's see how this works see if we if we turn uh, if we press right arrow turns right side and if we keep and if we click left arrow turns left side and it moves and the, the code for the toby that's all so now you can just turn on the sprite just wall right okay, so this ball seems too big I'll just say software, I'll just say software. I'll give eighty percent. This will be right. Uh now go to V events and drag and drop when green flag clicked. Go to looks and drag and drop show. And then go to for controls and take forever. And Drag and drop next costume and go to controls and drag and drop create clone of myself. Okay. Create clone of myself and it'll give a uh, weight 0 0.8 seconds. So now drag and drop when I start as a clone and then go to motion, drag and drop, go to X, Y. Uh, so, so now let's just see, keep it a uh, little bit, what can be there. So if you saw, you can keep Y as 164 and X as Pick random to 
minus 220 to plus 220. Okay. So I put the controls and take forever. So um, I will drop next costume to the further one more time. The, the, the color of the ball changes. So I will give. Okay, so it's don't need here. Don't need. Now let's take change y by minus y. Change y by minus y. And let's go to controls and drag and drop if then. So if 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 it touch if it touch the color, touch the bottom of the background. Then it should this then then should it should be deleted. But, so let's do that. Yes, if that's just brown color, then it should be deleted. So if that's if the touching color this uh, delete this clone. Okay, so again, drag and drop if then. So now, if touching Toby, so if touching Toby, then switch backdrop to backdrop one uh, hide and stop all before that uh, let's broadcast a message hide broadcast game over so that's it Toby. So now, now I can just click uh, Toby. Okay. So when I receive game over looks and drag and drop hide so now, now so now let's see how the game works oh, just before that I'll just keep in the corner okay so now let's see how this game works see This dot wall and if it touch oh I think if I forgot one thing if it switch to in backdrop one let's type it this type here game over and curly in size let's change its color to Red. Okay. So now, now, now let's see how this works. See, it's come to game over. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, like it, share it, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Sicily Coding.